Okay, that is all recording whenever you're ready. Yeah, I'm recording on this side. Just waiting for you. Okay. Hello there, everybody. The name's Prototype, and welcome back to a very long-awaited um, video. Uh, sorry I haven't been around a lot, but I had to... Uh, I'll be explaining all this in a vlog so, um, later on, but basically I'm back now, and we are go I'm joined by a good friend of mine, Black Virtue. Oh, hello! I thought you here. Um, if you, if the people who don't know Black Virtue, he is a streamer. Uh, he, I'll link her description, or in the description, I'll link. Uh, I'll put a link to his uh, Twitch page. Um, Thank you much. So, um, so yeah, we are playing Dawn of War Two, the um, original Dawn of War Two, um, and we are going to be going on Captain mode. Yeah, I believe that's uh, the hard, but not super hard mode. Yeah, Primark, just, as you were saying off off stream, uh, off the recording, the Primark just is just going to hurt. Yeah, things were like all enemies deal some like five times damage. It's just like no, no, thank yeah. you. And also, um, I haven't got a um, um, webcam up. Ooh, what on earth is going on? Oh, ah, screen. Yep, yeah, we've just lost prototype to the warp, guys. Terribly sorry about that. Uh, <laughs> what's uh, going on with my screen? I, I can't see this. I, I'm just assuming that uh, the heresy has uh, been strong with this one. Oh my gosh, what now? Uh, oh, it's just split into four. Yep, Zinch has been awakened. Sorry, guys. I... Uh, I have a tendency to break games. It, it's, it's been a while since that, you know, screwed up the player as well. I don't know what I need to do. Yay! Um. <laughs> um. Okay. Um. I'm gonna have to just shut down everything. <laughs> okay. Should we just stop recording for a moment? Yeah, <laughs> stop recording. Um, right, I think we've dealt with the dirty heretic. Well, um, hello again. Heresy. <laughs> hello again. Heresy. Everybody. Yeah, it. Um, I tried to recover the farm my side, but it um, it's not happy at all. Heresy. So, um, yeah, let, let's try that again. Yeah, see if we can get further than the starting screen. Man. Man, that Primark difficulty. <laughs> you can't even complete the starting screen, man. <laughs> no. <laughs> Bro, that, that's hard. Okay, let's see if we can get across to prototype. Yep. Okay, Captain... Let's go! Yay. I have no idea what's going on. This cluster of worlds stands on the very edge of the Imperium of Man. From this frontier came the Blood Ravens, a chapter of the Emperor's own space Marines. I can totally try to narrate through that, but all I heard was gunshots. Yeah. Captain Davian Thule and a handful of space marines lead the raw recruits defending these worlds. Now, another space marine joins this desperate battle. A yeah, newly promoted head. commander, ready to lead in our darkest hour. You are this space marine. Yay! And you will tip the balance toward victory. Heresy! Heresy. Heresy everywhere, apparently. Well, that's basically what the space wounds are. They basically go, oh, that's a, that's a heresy over there, and that's a heresy over there. So it's the only thing you really need to remember about Warhammer 40k. It's just like, is it an ultramarine? No, then it's a heretic. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. It's a heart attack. 
So yeah. No, um, if you're wondering, uh, you can also see posts I've over on my Twitch channel most Saturdays with some DDO. Hmm. Calderas. We Blood Ravens select our initiates from this world's fierce warriors. Calderas is the cradle and the future of our chapter. Now, the orcs would take it from us. This we cannot allow. Mm hmm. All right. Let's see if we can get some game action a little bit. Stay in cover. Kill the orcs that are out in the open. in command here on Calderas. We are battling the orcs that threaten this world. You have dropped right into the combat zone. I am really? of you with several squads of our initiates. We are well, under that, fire and losing That's how 40k works. Move north and provide support. Oh, so you're I have the, no uh, UI yet. You're the uh, Space Marines. I'm Tarkus! Yay! I get ability. I've got frag grenades, cool. Limited frag grenades. Okay, I'll be a lot more careful with them. Yeah, I've got a uh, healing as well. I've only got a select few of them as well. There we go. Oh, my armor is so, so poor. Kill the damn orc. Another grenade up there. Bolter. Bolter. Commander. But the green skins will not give us much time before they attack again. I need you and Sergeant Tarkas to take charge of driving the orcs back. Move up to the ruins east of here and prepare to repel the next orc wave. Yay. Um, I don't know if he's giving you those new two new guys because I can't use them. Hmm? The two guys that we just rescued, I can't use them. I don't know. Oh, okay. No, I can't use them. Basically, what I can do, I can, uh. Well 
done, Commander. Those orcs have opened a path through the hill somehow. Move forward and seal it. Uh, also, these things on the um, the crates and such, they, uh, from what I can remember... Yeah, they contain they... bonuses. Oh, crap, I need to run away. Oh, hold on, come back. Hey, thank you. Yeah, these ones here. If you want to so get that. Or does it give it to both of us? I think so. Yeah, nice one. Yay, double up. The greenskins are clearly using that mine as a passage, Commander. Seal uh, that entrance by any means necessary. Um. Hmm. The orcs have stacked fuel. And oh, okay. Near the entrance over there. Like, well, please we did what? Ignite it and bring the whole cave down. No, it's going to grenade, apparently. The Greenskins will not be using that passage again anytime soon. Yeah. But the leader managed to escape through the tunnel before we could kill him. That was our chance to cut this invasion off at the head. He will show himself again, Tarkas. And when he does, we will be ready. Thunderhawks are en route. Prepare for extraction. Yay! But there's still most of the map. Okay. Yeah, it's... It... It's a uh... chainsaw. Ooh, I'll be using that one. So you got a chainsaw and a bolter, basically. Yeah, one for each of us. Welcome aboard, Strike Cruiser Armageddon, Commander. Calderas is currently facing a massive orc invasion that threatens to spill over to the entire sector. Urgent distress signals are coming from other nearby sectors, but we must concentrate our efforts here. I need you to take charge of an assault that's stalled on the surface below. Mm -hmm. Drop to the point marked on the planet map and start pushing into the orc's flank. I just got, yeah, it's the, um, the support items with the grenades. Do the nice squads. Cool. Um, taunt. Mm. Bolt specialized. Using the bolter. Six, and then five. Master of grenades, level three. Um, also. Okay, I can either get. What's that? For a limited, limited time, the Force Commander performs special attacks with every hand to hand strike, doing damage and knocking enemies to the ground. Additionally, the Force Commander cannot be knocked down for the duration. Load up, gain accessory. Destroy the Force Commander, gains it's energy, and click an energy. The improved bolter looks to be actually slightly. Oh no, it is slightly better. Yeah, a little bit more damage. Yeah. Hmm. Um. Uh, I think I'm gonna get more health. Yeah. Increase the charge of to victory. Yeah, I'm charge. gonna get more. I'm gonna get. One health and one combat. Okay. So, retake the hamlet. Or when you're ready. Uh, I'm taking a quick look at what's around. I think I'm going to go down. Well, health isn't too useful, but I've all got through bolters to grab bolt specialist, and then I'm going to probably go reach up the other ones. Hmm. Okay. Ooh. Spot load out, spot deployment. And so on. Okay, yep. Yeah. Right, I'm good. Cool. Let's go and retake the hamlet. The greenskins have taken God damn orcs. The hamlet outside God damn heretics. This hamlet sits on a vital supply route, and all of the will fall if we do not dislodge them. Sergeant Avatus and his squad of Devastator Space Marines held the hamlet alone. But they were finally overwhelmed. Oh, okay. You must retake the I don't know if I need to hit something to say, yeah, go to the next. To aid yeah, in this. I'm just uh, I'm waiting for this and then and the squad of I'll click to your deploy. His infiltration expertise should prove invaluable. Oh! I've clicked it. Two, one, blast off. 
Yep, we cut him off mid-speech because I forgot to click the button. Oh, sorry. That's fine. They'll catch the story on your side anyway. Yeah. See, I'm, I'm just about gunning down heretics. Just point me in the direction of heretics. <laughs> Foolish forks. We have more DACA. In position. I have looked. Space Marines, heartening news. Avatus, the squad leader who defended the hamlet, is still alive. The orcs incapacitated him. Oh, right, she got uh, more squads now. Avatus yeah, you've got Cyrus the scouts. So it would seem, Cyrus. An orc guard position stands between you and Sergeant Avatus. Approach with stealth and eliminate the green skins. Understood. Okay. The thing is, what I think I'm going to do with uh, this guy is to, uh, or with the captain, is to go and disrupt their cover. Okay. Let me go and, uh... Okay. Fuck the guard tower, I've got grenades. Mantle of the Great Father. Avatus's position is on your tactical display. Revive him so that he may join your attack. Be vigilant. Uh, damn orcs found another pass through the hills. There is a relay beacon near your position, Commander. Secure it, and we can deploy reinforcements to fill out your squads. Be vigilant. Reinforcements inbound. Focus fire. Uh, cool. Excellent. Yeah, nice. Habitus and his Devastator squad are back to full strength. Now, push into the hamlet and eliminate those orcs, Commander. I'm going to set the Devastator step behind. Are turning tail. They could be going for help. Stay alert. I think I'm gonna get my guys to infiltrate. And go a little bit further ahead. Okay. But the devastator is set up just behind this wall. My squad should set up in heavy cover. Oh, there we go. The suppressive fire from my heavy bolter will keep the green skins pinned. Oh crap, okay. There. Devastators ready to fire. Our heavy pulses are deadly. They take time to set up and have a little fuel to fire. Charge! I say it's a lot easier when you've actually can, you know, control individual units. Yeah. Why am I? Because there's just too many people otherwise. My, oh, my scouts have just gone down. Okay, he needs to go back to that point and get some more um, people, so if you could wait for him to come back. Sure, I'll set up behind that cover. Oh, there's a beacon just here, actually. Oh, was there? So, yeah. Oh, well, he's all the way back here now. Commander. There is a second relay beacon near your position. Activate it to finish securing the hamlet. Right, got a support item. I'll just grab one of those. Ones. I should probably want them out and them. Work, Commander. The hamlet yeah. Is secure. More just what it's suggesting. Way, Commander. Set up your forces to repel the attack. Uh, this no. Must not um, I can't remember what I was suggesting. Well, I put the devastators in the tower and the main guys oh, okay. are just in cover. Works on a 
approach. Come on, Dreamskins! Raven Mantle! Fair the Righteous, that looks more your sort of thing. Oh, that was a close grenade. Michael, for you. There we go. Okay, I'll move into grenade the other guys. Oh, it heals everybody. Nice. Well, if you grab that, because I've used some grenades and. I think that should have been spent replenishing bed pit. Yeah, it does. Well done, Space Ooh. Marines. Thunderhawks are on approach to return you to the Armageddon. Really? But well, there's so much more map. Well, we it's the same map as we were on the first mission, so I think we're just slowly moving across it. Oh yeah, fair enough. There's a tutorial bit. Plus da -da -da. ten armor rating, plus four range damage. That's a great father. To capital. Well done, Commander. With the hamlet cleared, we can secure the main route. Yeah, just by splitting the command between two people, it's so much nicer. Yeah. Captain Thule. Cyrus is correct. Someone is agitating the orcs and pointing them at valuable targets. I think it really needs to be the kind of like split war, control between things, out who is mm. using the green or against us. you know, not having active abilities. So the way um, Age of Mythology did it, right? There's the Raven Mantle and Improved Power Armor. I, I don't mind if I get anything or nothing of that. Okay, uh... Evil, however, get... Uh, ooh! Further range. Hmm. Da -da -da. Okay, that's quite cool. Uh, Specialist Ammunition with uh, more training. Is a Cyrus can uh, unlock uh, special a specialist ammunitions like sniper rifles and such. Right, cool. Well, I just gave the storm bolters more range because fuck yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot to ask. What's your language policy? Because my language policy is it's English. Shut up. Uh, no swearing for me if you can help it. Okay, I will try to keep the swearing down. Hmm. Raven Mantle or 4% range damage, even though I don't do range damage. Well, I could throw it on one of my guys, yeah. or you can throw it on Cyrus. Uh, I can't throw it on Cyrus. It's uh, not scout armor. Okay. Doop. I've got my main guys. They're shooting lots. Okay. Okay. Uh... I don't know why I've got so much armor and such and weapons and such. I think it's just the initial kit. Yeah, maybe. Uh, right, so communications away or skillers raid. Hmm. There's an automated foundry or an imperial shrine. Auto automated foundry, uh, many worlds, assistance the protection of arms and munitions while serving the various needs of the populace. Skin item will grant additional support and allow the directed deployment of uh, tarantula touch during the mission. That's kind of cool. That's quite cool. Whereas um, the other one is um, channeling the will of the emperor, basically. I think Turris is more uh, more uh, needed. Okay then. The target. Uh, but anyway, that's the all we've got time for for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Oh, okay. Uh, doing oh, it in oh, fifteen oh, minutes uh, stints, so it's uh, um, so it's still well. We had the time before, so it's about fifteen, sixteen minutes, yeah. right about now. 
cool. Yeah, I'm not used to that, so you're going to have to call me out on that because I'm doing three hour stream. Yeah, yeah, it's completely different to how streaming works, so it's done. In... Yeah, yeah, that's all good. Right, so see you guys next yeah, episode. See you in the next episode, guys.